stuff uh, home and away here. Well, I think we're just trying to take it one day at a time, and we're just going to continue focusing on what got us to this point, and that's just getting a little bit better each day, and it starts in practice, and, and uh, hopefully it will carry over into our next game. Just what it has been, like, kind of, I don't know what the secret's been in these last three games. It just seems that everybody's starting to shoot while well. you're getting so many guys in, or girls in uh, double figures. It's just been kind of things are the ball's rolling. Well, I, I think we've... Uh, turned uh, our negative margin on our on the defensive end into a positive. I think we're a better defensive team. I think we're rebounding the ball better. Um, we've been able to keep uh, our last three games, our opponents to 55 to 56 points a game. And, and you know, we've had uh, some other, some players that have really produced a lot more offensively as well. We're shooting the ball better. Um, you know, just for example, Jackie Voigt's like double or tripled her uh, production from, uh, you know, the 0-7 run. So I just think everybody has stepped up a little bit and um, everybody's doing just a little bit more. A game like that one down in Indiana, is that the kind of game you've been looking for is to be able to come from behind and then and get a win, kind of reverse of what they did up here earlier in the season? Well, I, I think it's just finding a way to win. I, you know, you never want to be down by nine points with eight minutes to go in the game, but uh, I felt like we dug ourselves a hole. I thought we showed a lot of character and, and kind of turned the tables, uh, like you said, from the first time that we met them here. So it's nice to be able to see us come back from a deficit. Has it been easier getting out to practice? Has there been a more of an energy in, in these last couple weeks now that you guys are winning three in a row? Well, our players have always uh, stayed positive. We've got great team chemistry this year. The players have always bought in. They've always worked hard. I think they've seen the potential in this team, and, I, and they're really no different than they were during you know, the beginning of the Big Ten. So, I mean, that's a good thing that they're staying even keeled. They're staying grounded and just continuing to work hard. Talk about the matchup against Iowa. It seems like Minnesota's got a little bit more height, but Iowa playing very well all season. They are. You know, they're a very tough team to guard. I mean, they have players that they all shoot the ball, they all can handle, they all can all get to the rim. Um, they play extremely well together. Um, they've got a starting five that anybody can score in double figures, and they've, they've got a lot of balance. So, And plus, we're on the road to the Big Ten, and they play extremely well at home. Good, good. Oh, I guess so. Okay, that's one more then. Um, Buford and Loberg both seem to kind of caught, caught a little fire again. Uh, What's different than the last couple of weeks? Well, I think, uh, you know, Katie's uh, a lot more confident offensively, and I think she's able to keep herself on the court. I think at the beginning of the year she had some injuries and she got sick, and so she was kind of up and down, and I think she's been able to be a little more consistent for us just being on the court for us. And, you know, she's a scoring uh, presence inside in the paint, and I think uh, Kiara's just playing with a lot of confidence right now.